allow me to please introduce your very first speaker from Bright Star, ladies and gentlemen, which happens to be the world's largest wireless distribution company. It is my absolute pleasure to invite up on stage Mr. Ahmed Ashraf, who is the GM for the MENA region. Please give him a round of applause. Thank you, Osha. Yeah, I know it's the morning, but do give him a proper round of applause. Get some coffee inside of you. Thank you. Over to you, Ms. Remy. Thank you, Sham. Thank you. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Brightstar uh, started off its MENA operation about two years ago, but uh, we're the world's largest distribution company as we speak. Uh, our turnover last year of uh, devices distribution only was $20 billion, second to the Vodafone group, which did, which did about $10 billion uh, globally. So we're the world's largest wireless distribution company. In 2014 and to date in 2015, we acquired 2020 Mobile in, uh, across Europe. We acquired SoftBank's CNS Accessories Company in Japan. We have acquired Offwire Accessories in USA. Betel Network of Distribution in 26 states of India. That's what we acquired from Airtel uh, and Trio in Indo Indonesia. So we're growing our, uh, our global presence and regional presence in uh, key parts of the world such that we have uh, a, a full view of what is happening across the globe on the wireless, on the mobile technology side. We have our presence in about 100 countries plus, and we have local offices in about 50 countries. So the MENA office is considered as one office which manages the entire Middle East and North Africa region. So that's our definition of our local physical offices right now. So that gives us literally presence and uh, uh, businesses all across the globe right now. We are part of the SoftBank Group. SoftBank Group is the world's largest group which has uh, 1,300 plus uh, investments in technology industry. SoftBank owns Sprint Network in uh, US, Alibaba, Yahoo, plus, plus, plus. Uh, it's a Japan-based company. Masasen is the CEO and the founder of SoftBank, owner of SoftBank. It's the only company in the world which has a 200 years business plan. So, you know, Masasen has a very clear vision where the technology is today and where it's heading for the next 200 years. Brightstar is the main driver of a lot of SoftBank strategies across the globe in terms of our services and distribution that we give to the retail and distribution channel and also to the carriers and operators across the globe because we work parallel with both. We work on the distribution side, which we've just discussed, but bigger than distribution is our interaction with the carriers across the globe where we service more than 100 carriers, do a lot of services for them, which we'll talk about in the preceding slides. So, and then in robotics, again, SoftBank is the leading company which is investing in the robotics uh, uh, R&D across the globe, and we own, Masas and, and SoftBank owns a lot of companies which are doing the robotics uh, uh, R&D and, and you know, research right now. So on the global distribution side, we have the distribution where we do the device distribution and accessories distribution, which we'll talk about as a major topic today. On the services side, there are a lot of host of services that we give to the operators uh, exclusively. Some of them, these services are given to the retail channel as well, but uh, a lot of these services are uh, carrier-centric. On the supply chain side, we do manage the 3PL and 4PL logistics for a lot of carriers, 65 plus carriers across the globe, including Sprint, Telstra in US, uh, Vodafone Group in a lot of countries, MTN in uh, Africa, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. We have our own omni-channel solutions, which are taken by the likes of Best Buy in the US, uh, even uh, uh, some, some of the biggest uh, e-tailers across the globe. These are the ones which are, again, mobile-centric. So what happens is when you go to a Best Buy store in the US, when you're buying your washing machines and all the other things, that's where you use the Best Buy point-of-sale system. But the moment you come into the mobile side, that's where Brightstar's uh, point of sale system comes into place. We have devised a system or a POS which enables a customer to take the device, do the carrier, uh, uh, you know, SIM or program uh, attachment, do the accessories attachment, do the bundling on the insurance side, do the bundling on 
uh, on the extended warranty side and have a checkout with the entire product already. So our expertise and forte is the mobile side and where everyone across the globe works with us uh, on, on these products that we have. Again, we have uh, uh, next big thing is the mobile digital solution. We have partnered with a lot of companies on uh, video, music, apps, and other rich content that we supply to our carrier partners. We have uh, on the insurance and protection side, East Securitel is an insurance company that is owned by Brightstar. And uh, based on that, we have devised a proper insurance program, a device insurance program for the mobile handset that we give to our retail partners as well as for our carrier partners. On the buyback and trade-in, MPX is the world's biggest uh, uh, trading house in Hong Kong. Brightstar owns MPX. Uh, that acquisition happened about three, four years ago. Currently, we're the world's biggest buyback and trading company. We are the global exclusive partners for uh, Apple, uh, for the entire buyback that we do for, on behalf of Apple across the globe. We pick up about 400 to half a million devices a month only on, from the Apple collection. Apart from that, we buy everything from a Samsung to a Lenovo to any kind of device. Currently, we're working with a lot of retailers across GCC, and we want to expand that network beyond GCC into the MENA region as well. On the financial solution, we work with the carriers, whereby we own the entire device portfolio of the carriers, and we then help the carriers fund uh, and help and fund the carriers in the device leasing programs as well. So here we work as a bank, and we take the entire device portfolio of the carrier's books, and we buy, purchase, and, and then uh, divide, uh, you know, construct the leasing programs for the carriers and uh, run through the entire food chain for them. On the accessories portfolio, which is our uh, focus for our presentation or uh, our presence in uh, DISTRI, we, are, uh, we have a global strategy where we source globally and then implement that sourcing locally to the opcos or the regions that we work in. We have global sourcing teams sitting in Japan and Asia Pac, which is Hong Kong and China, and also in US, Europe, and Latin America. Now what happens is that these global teams are interacting on behalf of uh, Brightstar local opcos and sourcing and then signing contracts uh, uh, all across the globe. Now, these guys are specialists in accessories uh, with history of 10, 12, 15 years doing nothing but accessories. Now, because of that, we then get access to a host of uh, brands that are totally new to this part of the world, and which is what we're showcasing over here in uh, Distri as well. Uh, and, and then, uh, you know, we adapt those available brands and uh, portfolios to our local uh, requirements and then pick and choose what we need in the local uh, markets. SoftBank Accessories Group uh, did a total turnover of 1 billion USD last year. We're the, one of the biggest accessories distribution company in the world. This uh, majority of this came from two parts of the world, Japan and US. This year in 2015, we have a vision of expanding our accessories portfolio across various territories that we have. So we've had the uh, uh, European rollouts, we have the Turkey rollout, we have the uh, Africa rollout, and now we're on to the uh, MENA rollout. And then likewise, we're doing similarly in the APAC and Australia region. So by the end of another year or two, <clears throat> we have a vision of taking our accessories portfolio to a total of 3 billion plus USD and become the biggest accessories distribution company in the world, giving us the scale and the power to do uh, things that others can't do. Currently, some of the key brands that we have in our portfolio globally is, is uh, here's the list. You all know these brands. Some of the brands are unknown, but most of these are known. What we have picked up uh, as the initial launch phase for the Middle East and North Africa region is, uh, is, uh, is, are these 12, 13 brands. Ski is our own brand where we fill in the gaps that are not available in terms of pricing, in terms of product assortment uh, uh, in our portfolio. We have Selly, which is a, a brand that provides uh, the entire range of accessories uh, uh, across uh, all protection, charge, listen, and gaming. 
then we have Liquipel on the fashion we have adopted. This, is, uh, this brand is there in all Apple stores all across uh, Europe and uh, uh, US. On the charge, we have Key, Eyebolt, Case Power, Cull Charge. On the Listen, we have Caden, Harman Card and Jays, uh, Bang and Olufsen, Jabra. And on the gaming side, we have exclusive rights on SteelSeries, which is one of the leading brands on uh, gaming accessories right now. We also have global exclusives that we sign up with uh, some of the vendors. These global exclusives are the products which we pick up in a couple of million units uh, uh, commitment, and we get extremely competitive pricing on these products. Usually we use these global exclusives for attachment. Currently we're doing a similar campaign in uh, Bahrain with uh, Viva, where we've, uh, we're attaching the Harman Kardon and Onyx speakers uh, with uh, high-end uh, smartphones and then similar products or similar attachments or similar campaigns can be worked out on these global exclusives that we have. The objective over here is that the price that we get on these products is, uh, is not available to anyone else across the globe. That's the commitment that we have from these suppliers and uh, these are some of the best suppliers in the world. The next big thing that is happening on the accessories uh, side is, uh, uh, is the Internet of Things, or IoT. Now, Brightstar has a vision of uh, doing something unique on the IoT. We do understand that uh, there's a whole lot of accessories or uh, devices that are available. But what, what the retailers need right now is, uh, uh, is, is the ecosystem. So Brightstar, in uh, collaboration with SoftBank and Key, is creating an ecosystem called Space, which is going to be our proprietary ecosystem. That uh, we can then uh, white label that ecosystem and then uh, give it to our partners for them to, uh, to use it as their own ecosystem and present it to their customers. So if uh, uh, the local retailers like Carrefour or Jumbo, they have uh, a vision of going into the IoT, rather than just selling the, the various devices and having customers not knowing what to do, they can have their own white label ecosystem, take the devices, have a, a team of boys and girls going and implementing the solutions at the homes and managing through the ecosystem that we're creating. We're calling it uh, Space. We will roll out the ecosystem in third quarter of this year once everything is ready. Uh, in addition to the ecosystem, we are assembling uh, more than a, a couple of hundred uh, devices that will go or uh, connect with this ecosystem. We're covering areas like connected home, healthcare, wearable, safety, education, and toys. So in, in one shot, you will have the entire ecosystem along with the devices as a comprehensive solution, and then you can go in and make a big bang on the IoT space. Uh, like I explained earlier, we work with all the retailers across the globe, uh, Best Buy, Target, Tesco, Walmart, uh, online, offline retailers. Uh, these are the guys that we supply to on the accessories side and also on our uh, uh, channel solutions. And we also work extensively with the operators, and this is what we're doing right now as well. Even in the uh, Middle East market, I think the, the major difference we will make on the accessories portfolio will be with the carriers. Uh, we've uh, talked to a lot of carriers which are uh, interested in talking to us and uh, uh, you know, using our services, our expertise in the entire ranging of accessories over there. So uh, that's a channel which uh, from the accessory side we felt was untapped and untouched. And over the next uh, 12 months, we will be going very aggressively on that side of uh, the accessories uh, ranging. We do give retail consulting solutions to our partners in terms of uh, management of the portfolio, space planning, merchandising concept, display, uh, some of the examples of uh, displays we've done. This is, these examples are from SoftBank in Japan where uh, we've really made a big change uh, difference in, in the way accessories are sold in that country. The other thing that we do, and uh, this comes from our uh, devices management portfolio uh, experience. So just to give you an example, we did $20 billion worth of device turnover last year, and we had zero obsolescence and aging uh, as an organization. How we do that is uh, through our vendor-managed inventory and uh, analytics. 
And this is the knowledge that we are going to uh, give to our uh, retail partners over here. We will integrate with the POS system. We will mon manage and monitor uh, the accessories portfolio on a daily basis, on a weekly basis. We will uh, look at the cash flows, which, which SKUs are giving the right returns, which SKUs are obsolete. Before they get into a 90, 120 days aging into the retail, we will give solutions to that. And we have a KPI, a global KPI, of keeping a healthy inventory on a 60-day basis. We've been able to do that, manage that on the devices side, and that is the objective we have on the accessory side as well. Not to just hand over or box move the accessories with our uh, partner, but do the VMI, give our partners the visibility and the analytics and the power to analyze what is doing good, what is doing bad, which, which uh, SKU or portfolio they should be keeping, which they shouldn't be keeping before it gets too aged or uh, dirty, and manage the whole uh, ecosystem. So that's uh, it from our side. Thank you very much.